And to what do I owe this pleasure? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to startle you there. No, it's just that people don't usually come here in the afternoon. Ah, uh, the storm. I guessed as much. Well, I'm the owner of this establishment. My name is Sierra. I'll be taking care of you today. It's nice to meet you too. Ah, uh, yes, you can stay here for as long as you like, sweetheart. Now you think about what you want to order while I fetch you some towels, okay? There you go. So, decide what you want. <laughs> An excellent choice. I'll be back in a minute. There you go. Care for a conversation? Well, this place tends to be very lonely in the afternoon, and you do look adorable. So, if I could, why, thank you. So, what's got you out in such terrible weather? Ah, uh, delayed schedule. Well, now I'm happy that I'm open around these times. So I can scoop lonely lost cuties like you. <laughs> uh, are you already getting a fever from being out there? Is that a blush I see? Ah, oh, come now. How am I supposed to stop myself here? It's not every day that someone like you wanders into my place. So I'm just making the most of this situation. Walking from one storm into another, eh? I like the sound of that. Though it does make me sound a little vicious. But unlike that storm, I won't make you sick. Well, maybe a little lovesick. Oh no, I'm not like this with everyone. It takes a special kind of person to bring out this side of me. <laughs> You want me to refill you? Aw, oh, that's no trouble at all. It's my job, ain't it? So do you live around these parts, or... Huh. Settling in nicely, then. If you ever need someone to show you around town, I'm more than available. I live two streets down from here. Which makes my morning commute real easy. Pretty much only use my car when I go shopping. Oh, that's actually not too far away. So did you move for work or because the neighbors just weren't your type of folk? Well, look at you, fancy pants. Well, it's certainly fancier than me and my little shop here. True, not everyone could run their own place, but... I wasn't sure I could do it either back when I started out. Now it feels like the most natural thing ever. And on days like this, well, it ain't very hard. <laughs> Though, I understand why people might not want to come with the weather like this. It doesn't get them in the mood for coffee and biscuits. <laughs> yeah, I sell biscuits and all kinds of baked goods. And bring some over for you. Oh, no, no. The way your eyes lit up when I mention them tells me all I need to know. Here's a little collection. Muffins, pretzels, cookies, and a couple of other things in the display case. My favorites are the pretzels. Especially the marmalade-filled ones. That's how I like them. So that's how I make them. It's just something I came up with one day. Came up better than I thought when I tried it. I also have chocolate covered ones. This is on the house, so feel free to dig in. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you like them. You know, I'm starting to hope that this storm lasts all night. Because I want to spend much more time with you. Oh, really? You've got nothing else to do today? Well, how fortunate for me. 
Let me turn off the sign then. I'll give you all my attention.